Hello everyone and welcome back to Steel Division 2. Today we're going to do another historical battle. I saw you guys really liked the Terminus Crop Key. We are going to play against the AI to help you fight against the AI because uh, I've had uh, Badger Jelly telling me uh, it would be better to play against humans and in theory I would agree on that sentence that playing against the human is better. But the point here is to help you guys get um, throughout, through these challenges. So I believe Stemming the Tide I've played already. I'm gonna film it this time or maybe I already film it. If so, I should have done my research uh, before the video. Um, let me just hobo tango Stemming the Tide on, Google, on the YouTube. I did it and it lasted 40 minutes. So what I'm going to do is I'm not going to redo it. I will put it in the description though, or I'm going to put it also at the end of the video. Um, I'm going to do desperate measures. <coughs> now I did claim that Terminus Kupke was easy for me at least. And I think it's a very easy scenario to do, uh, just because all you need to do is send waves of infantry and tigers into the one town. And that's about it. But I haven't played much of the other one, if at all. So I really, I don't know what I'm going to be expecting here. And so I think it's going to be fun. But if you guys, uh, if, you know, this these videos are aimed at newer players. So even though I haven't played these scenario, I'm still going to be able to point you out on what would most likely be the best strategy and if not well at least it's going to be fun to see me lose <laughs> or it's going to be fun for you to watch i think um just there's a lot of viewers that watch the previous video so i i assume you guys like that kind of content so there you go so Plesjenitsi, july 1st 1944 i'm sure you can read all of that for yourself but basically while the lead element from fifth panzer division managed to hold back the main soviet armed force along the moscow minsk highway fast moving cavalry and mechanized troops had forced their way across the berezina river um soviet control flanks to the support of local partisan in the skies above the Luftwaffe made a special effort that day matching the soviet air force so we can control Panzer Regiment 31, Kampgrufit Yadke, 35th Guard or 8th Guard Mechanized. I have no idea what to expect. I would prefer the one with the most infantry, I think, just because the AI can be kind of stupid with the infantry. Uh, but then again, they can be really stupid with the tanks. Um... <clears throat> Let's try it with Panzer Regiment 31. His new attack and a desperate counter attack against the crossroad. Alright, so this is the new attack, I'm guessing. We're gonna take the attack. Alright. Um Whoa, uh there you go. Uh okay, here I am. We're gonna put this to hard. And there you go. And hopefully I'm going to be able to win this. If I was able to win Terminus Krupke, which is a 2v1, I think with a 2v2 should be a little bit easier there. Alright, here we are in battle. We're going to have to secure the crossroad. Terminus Kropke was a defensive battle, so I believe these are much more easier to do. So secure the crossroads, secure the road to Beguml. So that would be the road to Begum. And we also have to secure the road to Molodocino. Molodocino, uh, which I would imagine is here or maybe going there. All right, all right. And we, we can line everywhere the ai is taking this road so i think i'm gonna go and take this at first and then i'm gonna help the ai go and capture this this is gonna be very hard to take because look at that it's right beside the the reinforcement <coughs> or we could go with the ai all together and help secure this and this kind of try to stop the enemy from landing here and then all we need to do is go here I, actually this is what we're gonna do 
So I'm just going to put a support unit right here. What else do we have actually? Recon infantry is decent. All right, we don't have a lot, but we do have some. Tanks is going to be decent in phase C, but I've only got two. I'm going to have to rely on my AI. And tank is not going to be great, but we are going to use this guy already right here. <coughs> machine gun, anti-tank, and I think I'm going to put another machine gun with the anti-tank. Do I have Air Force? I do. I got a recon. Oh, I only got 60 points now. So we're going to try to hold this. And then with the 60 points we have less, we'll put some infantry around in these houses. Do we have fast moving infantry? We only got a machine gun. Hmm. Let's try to put to push the machine gun around here and see how we do with that. I'm going to even put a recon in front of us just to make sure that we can indeed get over there. <coughs> Actually, we do have a recon in the form of the uh, of the plane here. I think we're we're just going to concentrate on more armed forces. So there you go. We'll put a 15 bucks recon instead. The more I can bring to the front line, the better it will be. And um, yeah, I think we're going to use a grill just for... Well, wait, because the AI has Panzer Force coming. We're going to put some infantry. And I want fast-moving infantry. There you go. So in this game, it's really important to take ground as fast as possible. And so, without further ado... Let's start this. Here looks good. They are some... Uh, oh boy, they have Emchas. These are really hard against the infantry, so we're going to have to be careful there. Let's unload here. Stop these dudes. Oh, fuck. Eh? Let's un... Alright, move like this. We're going to move our machine gun forward. Um, I'm going to bring some anti, well, no, actually, yeah, I'm going to bring some anti-tanks to support myself. Scratch that. Ah, oh, fuck. I didn't want to take that recon plane. I wanted to take, uh, the Fokker Wolf. Wow, they're going to be strong on Air Force. Alright, just, uh, just some general commands to my... Alright, BF-109 at least survives. So, there you go. Now is the time to bring anti-air. We're gonna destroy these planes. <coughs> and try to save that BF-109 from total destruction. The AI has brought his Gepard anti-air here in, in front of everything. Dumb AI. Yak turning to get killed. No!
All right, you. We really need to manage our uh, our units very good. We're gonna bring this guy here. Go go go. Let's get this guy. Try to save our. Never mind. Bring some infantry. And we're gonna live to fight another day. There you go. Go away. Go away. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Okay, okay. I think we're safe. Just go away! What bullshit is that? Oh my god. Okay, alright. We've made it. These guys are not helping us very much. There you go, Pack 40 is going to do a number here. Let's bring a recon. We're definitely going to need more hair. There you go. Kill that. Let's retreat, live another day. Let's unload everyone and let's start moving. Definitely going to take a grill now. Here they're doing pretty good. Here our defenses are holding. It's really just a matter of taking this here. Um, All right, that's good. Let's fall back. If you press fall back, they'll take less damage. Right now, I could use less damage on these. Um... Look at the... All of these tanks serve no purpose. Uh, we're just gonna retreat from there. Live to fight another day. These guys are doing nothing. And we're gonna put this dude there. I guess we could use some artillery ourselves. There you go. We're gonna put some smoke because now we're pretty much fucked uh, with all the defenses they got. <coughs> the AI died here. We still got 23 minutes. We're good enough. Let's retreat for now. Um, let's put a dude there. We're gonna keep moving. And now that I have some mortars coming in, I am gonna put. Um, I'm gonna bring my tanks with. Uh, I'm gonna destroy this with mortars. There you go, some good thing happening here. Who else is dying around? Alright, some enemy vehicles, so that's good. <coughs> Let's retreat. And there you go. Oh. Oh boy, okay, he was shooting at my grill. There you 
There you go. Um, let's come back here. There you go, nice job here, nice job. All right, we're going to unload here. All our guys, pioneers, there you go. Let's go. I'm going to need some smoke here, obviously. So let's do this right away. Actually, let's go in town as well. Alright, so that is one thing done. Let's put our Air Force here so that next time there's something happening, um, we'll be able to counter it. Let's go here with these dudes. Ah, there you go. Counter. Counter. Let's move forward here. Come on, destroy. And um, this could be good. Come on, just destroy something here. Do we have supplies? We do. Let's bring some supplies to our mortars. We're going to take a commandant as well, and let's try to bring some veterancy around here. Fuck. All right, let's move forward here. Alright, maybe we should bring some people around here now. Um, uh, machine gun could be... Mm. There you go. We're going to have to retreat from here. Hopefully, uh, he's not going to catch up to me. Alright, good thing, good thing here. Let's move fast around. Oh no, my Panther at... This distance might get destroyed. <laughs> I 
I wish the AI would provide us with a little bit of help here. We're going to have to advance a little bit further and uh, keep moving here. Okay, the tanks here are helping us. <coughs> I'm going to have to start bringing some IG-18s. There you go. Actually, anti-air could do good as well. There you go. Actually, this guy is running out of ammo, so there you go. How is it going here? Pretty bad. Let's go. Let's move in. All we need is this. Let's go. Ah, these poor fucking dudes there. Just getting completely smashed. Let's go, let's go. Nice. Alright, let's go. Let's try to capture this with these two we have. Let's bring this here. I thought I called in two, but there's only one. This guy. Let's go. Let's move in here. We're almost there. If only I could get some... <laughs> Tank support. Uh, where's the L button? Let's move in with our infantry around here. Get some there. Oh no, come on dude, do not die on me, I need you. Fuck. <coughs> okay, I think we're, I think we're gonna do this. Oh man, these fucking air forces. Here's my dudes, let's go. Move in here and then unload there. Alright, we gotta go out of here.
Okay, so we've we've got this now. Major defeat for them. This is great. Let's try to keep pushing over here. Do we have tanks? Yeah, but not the money. Uh, no, we don't actually. More infantry around here. And might as well call a leader too here. Actually, let's go there and here. We're going to use these guys for uh, air support as well. All right, let's go. Let's go. If we can capture this, it will be great. Ah, oh, that sucks. Fifty-six second. These assholes are not providing me with any tank support whatsoever, and it kind of sucks. Oh shit! Alright, let's just take position here. Okay, that's gonna help a lot. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Because the AI here is so useless. Let's go destroy this thing. I think here we're good. We got 3 star infantry. Uh, we got another one coming in. We'll put him just here. It's still a major defeat for... Ah, oh, fuck, he's going away. Alright, help me here, dude. These guys. Unload. Attack there. 3 minutes 51 seconds. And, <clears throat> and we're gonna win this. We might lose this at any moment now, um, but you know, let's try to do something. Wow. Let's keep killing his air force. Oh boy, commander's gonna die here. As long as I'm holding this, and where's my tiger? Move, my friend, move. I need you to kill. Ah, oh, no, 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 no. I'm gonna put him on quick hunt, but here's the thing, I'm gonna remove the machine gun and HE so that when he advances, he only starts shoot he only stops to shoot at oh, I'm gonna lose my leader right here. Oh nice. Oh Okay. I've got one unit holding the ground here. This is an attack fail uh doomed to fail, unfortunately. Why isn't the AI pushing here with his tanks? Let's go do something. 
We've got two minutes to hold the tide. Same thing I'm gonna do with these dudes. Just fucking move in, move in. Uh, IG-18 provides some good infantry support. Machine gun to do pretty much the same thing. This as well. Come on. All the ground. One minute. Oh yeah, we got this. We got this. Um, yeah, let's go there. It's going to be safer. Ah, god damn. I hate the AI and its artillery use. Uh, but it's working. It's working. 50 second. If only this guy can hurry up a little. He's just chilling there with his little planes. Let's move. Let's go. Let's reactivate these. Because um, now we don't really need it. Uh, there you go. We've won that. We've won that. Let's put just uh, off map. Uh, right here. And then move away. Press pause. Because now that's the end of the game. <coughs> and I want to give um, a little. Some pointers. Because playing the game is good. But we got to give some pointers as well. So from what I get, and keep in mind in medium it's going to be easier because um, oh I think it I think an art AI doesn't get any bonus actually uh, I could be wrong but anyway uh, let's keep some pointers here was completely useless I mean it does help with the front line um, but we're not playing the human here so the AI I don't think the AI really cares much about the front line plus. Um, there's no uh, there's no flag around here, so it's kind of pointless. But if you could bring these guys with, uh, you know, the two T34 we had at first, we could have destroyed that tank that was here, and we could have went on to capture this. But then again, the AI could have bring a lot of tanks because notice they do have a lot of Shermans. So I think this you can safely say, forget about it. It's not important. They still get a major defeat uh, just by capturing these two. What we should have done, um, looking at it with some uh, hindsight, is capture this one first. So we should have went here, put a lot of infantry in these houses with, you know, maybe a machine gun here with AT guns. So yeah, capture this flag first. Use the houses for cover, the, the forest as well. Maybe put your leader here with a couple of infantry, a couple of mortars, you know. Um, try to take these with pioneers. We had pioneers in phase A to take these with pioneers. And an anti-tank maybe just here. And always use the cover if possible. See my arrow? Yeah, No cover, cover, great cover. So yeah, take this first, I would say. Then this uh, the AI got here way before us anyway, so they'll all they'll already take um, they're already half position whether you try to take this first or not. And then in phase B, you start building up your support weapon grill. You know, anti air anti air is very important in this game. I notice. Um, so as soon as you take this, build your anti air. Bring a couple of support weapon. You really, you know, splatter them across because the AI use a lot of artillery, and um, and then by phase C, I think it's safe to say you could make your push. Um, even phase B, you could try moving your infantry. Try to move your infantry around here if possible, because the enemy doesn't really have eye on it. Try to move maybe your infantry here. If you didn't manage to bring a couple of tanks, you could, you know, you could. Take this here uh, with maybe some machine guns, shoot at infantry here, 
and have a couple of tanks to support them in this forest. Don't bring your tanks too far like I did, but try to bring them just enough, just here, enough for them to support with machine gun against this little forest and swamp here. And then by phase C, you bring your tigers and it should be a cakewalk that way. So there you go. I hope you guys enjoyed. We're going to get to the end here. Major victory. <coughs> Kill list. 34 to 15. Uh, yeah, it was something to fight this. I think this one was much harder than Terminus Krupke. So, um, beware. And there you go. That closed the deal for our historical mission. I hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, next, we're going to do Last Hope near Lake Narach on the 4th of July, 1944. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.